So at the end of season one, we see, um, you know, Kimiko, who is this feral creature when we first see her in the season, transform into a more human-like being. And at the end of the season, there's a huge, she gets kidnapped and uh, Huey breaks his teeth to uh, <laughs> save her and Mother's Milk is coming in with his uh, strength to carry, literally carry her out. So there's a lot of um, trust that's built, I think, uh, within the boys at the end of season one. Beginning season two, she's trying to communicate with the boys so that she can, I think, assimilate a little more and be a part of the team. And I don't think I am allowed to say how she ends up communicating, but um, I think in the first or second episode, you see her uh, learning how to write and um, it's a cute little, cute little <laughs> thing she's doing. She's learning. <laughs> we figured it out for season three of what her favorite movies are. <gasps> nice. Oh. She loves, uh, she loves Hollywood musicals. That's her thing. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Oh. Me. So she'd be watching uh, like Seven Brides for Seven Brothers or or, or West Side Story or something. That's yes. What she oh my that's awesome. God, I'm so excited. Yeah. I didn't even know that. That's awesome. 